Hey guys, Cthulhu here. I just wanted to make a short tutorial on how to make this feature where objects are highlighted when you hover your mouse over them. Uh, this is super simple to make and it has no issues with performance. So yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is go ahead and add a part. This is just going to be so that we can see what our highlight looks like before we start putting on everything. So let's go in here, add a highlight. I don't want it to be filled with a color so we're just gonna make this full transparency one and this is already done for me this is the highlight i want to use oh except we are going to turn on occluded so that it is not always on top real quick guys one thing i wanted to mention is that you are going to need this tag editor plugin there will be a link in the description once you have that downloaded or if you already have it then let's continue the video once you're happy with the way the highlight looks we're going to go into starter player Starter player scripts, we're going to add a script. Uh, you can name this whatever you want. I'm just going to name this local highlighter. First things first, we're going to go ahead and define the local player. So just go ahead and do that. Once we have the player, we're going to want to get their mouse. So we're just going to say local mouse equal to player get mouse. The last variable we need to find is collection service. So we're just going to say local collection. Oh, one too many else. <laughs> local collection service is what a game get service collection service. Now we're just going to connect an event. to whenever the player moves their mouse, we're going to say mouse dot move connect. We're going to make a function. Okay. First, we're going to check if the mouse has a target and if not, then we're just going to return. And if it does, then we're going to check if it is tagged with our highlightable tag. Um, I'll show you how to create this in a minute if you don't already know how. We're going to say if plugin service has tag mouse the target. And then the name of your highlightable tag. For me, it's highlightable. Then, and then with the highlight that you copied earlier, you're going to paste it into your script here so we're just going to copy this you can say Control shift v to paste into or you can just right click paste into with that we're going to say script that highlight that adorny is equal to mouse.target and then we're just going to return so that it ends the loop here and it doesn't continue now to make this work with models that are um apparent of any part so that you don't have to individually mark each part it's pretty easy just add an else if statement we're gonna say else if comes with collection service has tag mouse.target.parent this will be the model and then the name of your tag then script that highlight that adorny i think you see where we're going with this so you go to mouse.target.parent and return Last thing we're gonna need to do is remove the Adorni every time the mouse is not hovering over something that you want highlighted. To do that, all you have to do is script that highlight dot Adorni is equal to nil. And that is the script done. Uh, but there is one issue. If you are hovering over an object and then you move your mouse directly over the, like, the sky, which is nothing, then it is not going to remove the highlight. So we're just gonna copy this, put it here, and there you go. The last step we're going to do, first off, we're gonna delete this object. Uh, you can name your part whatever you want. You're going to create a tag down here in the tag editor. To open this, go to your tag editor plugin, tag window. You're gonna add a new tag called highlightable. I already have it, so I'm not going to. And then you're just going to click on your part or your model and you turn this on and with that on you are done as you can see we walk over here and it is highlighted whenever you hover over it same thing uh, with the ones before so yeah if you found this video helpful all i ask is that you like and subscribe if you change your mind you can always unsubscribe later other than that thanks for watching and if you have any suggestions for future videos please leave a comment.
And yeah, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Holy crap! Donald Trump! Hello, Peter. Welcome to Fort...